of fake lux and you know, and that could have kind of threw him off, but it did. You know what I mean? B dot showed the fuck up. He was ready to fight. He had the same energy that he would bring anywhere. The same energy he would have on the West. He had. Um. Okay, so I watched the live. I'm gonna make this quick. I watched the live. And live. One of my niggas is the biggest A Verb fan. One of my niggas, Verb is this nigga's favorite battle rapper. I debate with this nigga all the time because, you know, Verb, Verb wasn't really one of my favorites. You know what I mean? This whole time he wasn't, he's one of my favorite people. You know what I mean? His personality, he's one of my favorite people. And I actually call Verb randomly a lot. You know what I mean? Just to pick his brain on certain shit. The nigga's smart as fuck. You know what I mean? He give me a lot of game. You know, Verb played a, a, a big part in in my development, you know what I mean, with the jewels that he gave me. And, you know what I mean, I took heed to it. But at the same time, as a battle rapper, I was never, just being honest with you, I never thought Verb was crazy, crazy. Um, just memorable performances, him versus Hitman, he was super dangerous in that. You know what I'm saying? Him versus Hollow, he was super dangerous in that. But this Verb I seen against Murder Mook, is the best verb I've seen. It's the best verb I've seen because a lot of times when verb is battling, he rapping with his head down. He ain't really engaged. He just, you know, he just everywhere with it. He was with the fucking smoke yesterday. He was with all that. He said it too. I'm with all that. I'm with all that. We heard you, verb. We heard you. And we believed it too. We believe you, my nigga. So even though you was up there looking like ketchup and mustard, we believed you, my nigga. You know what I mean? It's like, come on, you was kind of styling on Verb. You look like you got a McDonald's sponsor and all of that. Like, you was doing your thing up there, Verb. Um, but yeah, uh, so watching it live, you know, my, my nigga, that's the Verb fan, he couldn't stop smiling and he kept looking at me because, you know, I, I'm telling the nigga I thought Mook was going to win. I'm like, there's no way. Verb is going to walk in New York and beat the Harlem nigga when every time he came to New York, he lost the Harlem niggas. Um, but as the as I'm watching the battle live, I ain't going to lie. I'm feeling like, wait, Verb is kicking Mook's ass. And maybe a lot, a lot has to do with... A lot has to do with Verb going second in these long rounds. You know what I mean? Because when you got long rounds and a nigga go second, it's hard to remember everything or shit that the nigga that went first said. So that has a lot to do with why every, a lot of people is just giving it the verb clearly. A lot of people were saying 3-0 because of that. That's how I feel. You know what I mean? But watching it live, I feel like verb was kicking this man ass. Um, I watched it twice on the playback. I watched it twice. And, I, and I'm watching it as I'm watching it, I'm trying to remember what the last nigga said so I could compare it in my head as it's going along. The nigga Mook did some amazing fucking writing in this battle. And it's being so slept on. I see why some people is feeling disrespected when they hear that, when they hear people saying verb 30 them. I could see the nigga writing in this. He did a, a scheme longer than what fucking Chilla Jones would do. But I think that that hurt Mook too. You scheming for way too long, my nigga. Way too long. Like the second round, he had a scheme that was damn near half the round. And he already spent in 27 minute rounds. So he, with the liquor shit, it was fire. But you know what I mean? Um... It was fire, but, you know, it just was taking too long. But I don't have a winner with Mook and Verb. There's not no clear winner. I don't care. Like, a lot of people are going to sit there and say, no, you crazy. Verb smoke Mook. And then you got the other niggas. No, Mook smoke Verb. There's no clear winner. This is a classic. It's hard to really call a clear winner. You can't do that. It's no way possible. You can only do that if you like one nigga more than the other. And if you do, that's personal. That's your personal opinion, your personal assessment. Don't bring your personal feelings into a battle rap debate. Don't do that. Be objective here. Be objective here. Yeah, I could beat anybody. You know what I mean? I, I feel like I could beat anybody. But there's no clear winner for Mook and Verb. Let's make that clear. 
is it a, when I was watching it, did I feel like it was a classic? No. When I watched it back a few times, this is definitely a classic. This is definitely an all-time classic. The shit that they were saying to each other, they was really breaking each other down. They went at each other. The tension was high. Everything. 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 You know what I'm saying? Um. Uh. You said it's hard to be objective. I mean, you just got to be... It's not hard. It's not hard. I mean, if you understand the rap, if you understand rap or battle rap, it's not hard to be objective. It's not. Like, I watch these battles. I'm not fans of a lot of these niggas. I'm a, I'm a huge Mook fan and not so much of a Verb fan. But when I'm watching this, I'm like... Verb is kicking Mook's ass. It was it was surprising to me. It's like what the fuck, I, and I don't you know what I mean whether if Verb win or Mook win this battle, it makes me no difference. None. I didn't bet on this battle. I don't have no money out there. I don't none of that funny shit. I don't know. You know what I mean? I'm not in none of these niggas' clicks. I'm not Dot Mob. I'm not from St. Louis. There's no allegiance. I'm not being biased towards anybody. I'm being fair here. Y'all know. My opinion, my assessment on shit is straight down the middle. Anybody calling me biased for anything is just, it's just, I don't know what the fuck going on. But, you know what I'm saying? Um, yeah, so uh, Mook's, Mook's third could really drop by itself how long that shit was. But you can't really call that, man. I love the way Verb ended his third round, though. When he said, uh... He said, he said, this was eight minutes, um, but where I'm from, we just do what we say we're going to do. We don't talk that much, or we don't talk that long. I said, oh, my God. You know what I mean? That was that was just crazy. 